First impressions are key when it comes to job interviews, which is why a local nonprofit is helping to dress our veterans with donations. KITV4's Ashley Moser has the more local store. His new shirts may not be straight from the department store, but local veteran Stephen Mandale says they're just what he needs. This helps me get back on my feet. Uh, I experience a little bit of a, a negativism in my life, and I need a little bit of help. And this is a godsend. Mandawe served in the National Guard for six years in the 70s and has been a veteran ever since. He says after leaving the service, finding a steady job hasn't been easy, but today he's getting a helping hand. Today, uh, I'll get some pants and some shirts so I can look presentable and it'll uh, greatly enhance my chances of getting hired. <laughs> Organizers gathered 15 boxes and bags of donated suits, Aloha shirts, and shoes this month, and even some items for the Ohana. They say by giving our vets clothing, it could open up employment opportunities. If you look the part, you know, you may be able to impress, you know, the interviewer, you know, so that's exactly what we want to do. You know, a lot of people have the skill, they just don't look the part to get the job. We're collecting items and donations. Shadonna McFall founded Mo's Heroes and collects hundreds of donated items every month. As a veteran herself, she says it can be difficult for some to swallow their pride and accept help. But I want everybody to get the help that they need before they need it. Because my motto is if you stay ready, you don't have to get ready. But with a new wardrobe and haircut, Stephen is confident life will get better. I'm thinking there's no way I'm not going to get a job now. <laughs> Ashley Moser, KITV4 News.